Good evening. This is James J. James coming to you live from my PC to yours. We are going to do a house flipper. Uh, this is my first actual video that's going to be in the house flipper edition. I have some things that I want to try to do before Alpha 19 comes out and then when Alpha 19 comes out. If people are still interested, then I will continue doing the house flipper. Uh, but this is going to be the first POI that I do because it's for rent. Well, it says keep out because it's condemned, but I'm going to fix it up so it's no longer condemned. Um, so, we're going to go ahead and take a look, see, at what we have to do before we get into this. It's a, no wonder it's condemned, there's holes in the floor and a tree growing through the kitchen here. It goes straight back outside, that's a short house, and you got this big old hole in a wall over here. Yeah, that's going to be fixed. It's not a bad size living room here. There's a bunch of holes in the wall. Plumbing probably needs fixed. Lighting needs fixed. That's the kitchen. That's, oh, the floor is even rotten out. Look at that. Let's go upstairs and see what we got here. Some more holes. That was a nice size. Oh. Somebody packed up and left. It's not too bad of a house, but I'm going to... This bathtub really needs fixed. Somebody died in there. Well, that's a little storage closet here. Well, let's go check out the roof. Does this have a basement? Look oh. how bad the roof is. I mean, it looks pretty big. That yeah, roof definitely needs fixing. Gutters are gone. Chimney. Oh man, chimney's definitely need fixed. And it's not a very good view. I mean, it's just in a burnt desert biome. Yeah, burnt and desert biome. Yeah. But, I'm going to go ahead and clean this up. And then, um, yeah, we'll clean this up and we'll see you back here in just a few minutes. The outside is cleaned up, now I'm going to go clean the inside. All right, now that I've cleaned everything out, uh, I have to go through and everything. Well, everything that wasn't broken. I might change up the kitchen in here. Um, the upstairs, fix all the holes in the wall here. You have one line. This room's all nice and clean now. It's uh, got with all those broken windows. I think I might extend this bedroom. I'm not a hundred percent yet. I'm definitely going to extend this bathroom. Uh, don't need this walk-in closet in the bathroom. But if I do, it's going to be like a washroom. But I doubt it. But like I, said, I am going to rejuvenate that bathroom. This bedroom, like I said, it might expand into here. Have nice I might change it to a walk-in closet now. Yeah. Whatever that is. But it's a little uh, fixing up. So I'm going to go ahead and repair. Maybe add a few things here and there. Gotta fix the foundation. There's a bunch of 
piece of the road has a and I have to fix the roof. I have to fix this chimney. I might take it out. Not too sure yet. But I'm not sure that fix the roof. So with that being said, let me uh, get to fixing this thing up. I'll see you guys here too. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, uh, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. The finished project. The only thing I did not do. The only thing I didn't do was furnish the entire place. Okay, I am very nitpicky when it comes to furnishing. And I know it would take me a lot longer than it would if I would just, you know, regularly look at this house. So, I didn't furnish this. If you guys want to see me furnish this or furnish another one, let me know down in the comments below. I did put azaleas all the way around, gave myself a nice little path, a little walkway to the back side here. And you can also have a nice little walkway up front. All with that being said, like I said, I gave my big self uh, the driveway. Um, so yeah. That being said, let's go ahead and get rid of this condemned because it is no longer condemned. Well, let's go take a look inside, shall we? Let's have a walk right in here. I thought about doing wood. Wood on wood. So that's what I did. I did wood on wood. I like this carpet. I uh, opened it up a little bit more, gave it a little bit of bigger archway. I redid the fireplace. Yes, it was nice. The kitchen, I was looking for like a black and white, but I couldn't find any black and white, so I had to do it myself. I wanted the checkered black and white kitchen. And let's go check out upstairs. Flooring keeps the rug goes all the way up to the top. And then up here, I did a black marble with a nice little trim. Still, looks like you got really high ceilings. I opened this up so you can put your bed in here and have this as, you know, something else. But you can put your bed in this nice little nothing thing. I did rearrange the bathroom just a little bit. I extended it. I figured you'd put some uh, shelving right there with your sink and you know whatnot. Maybe your mirror vanity, put your toilet uh, on it. If stuff if you wanted a really long shower or a bigger shower, and I left the window here. Yeah, all in all, I actually like this house. I like how I did that. My favorite room is the kitchen, honestly. And come out here. I said you got yourself a nice little patio. You can make yourself start a garden out here if you wanted to. But that is it. Looks like we have a nice little walkway here. Zalia's all the way around. I didn't feel like putting any other flowers in. If you want to put your own flowers in after you buy the place, you're more than welcome to. Get yourself a Carport, maybe if you have a motorcycle, maybe for bikes, whatnot. But that is it. That is my first house flipper. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and if you want to see more, go ahead and uh, let me know down in the comments below. 
I appreciate everything. I appreciate the support that you guys have been giving me over these past few months. You guys are awesome. So until I see you again, be safe.